Linux Mint 21.3 Beta is the latest version of the popular Linux distribution, which is based on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. It comes with many new features and improvements, such as Cinnamon 6.0, the flagship desktop environment of Linux Mint, which adds support for a new type of add-on called Action, improves the performance and stability of the desktop, and introduces a new desktop zoom gesture. Hypnotix, the IPTV player, which now allows you to set channels as favorites for easier access and to add your own custom TV channels. Warpinator, the file transfer tool, which now supports connecting to another device manually by entering its IP address or host name. Artwork improvements, such as new wallpapers, icons, and themes. Window opacity key binding, which lets you adjust the transparency of the focused window with a keyboard shortcut. Stylus button configuration, which allows you to disable the buttons on your stylus if they interfere with your drawing. Notification monitor configuration, which lets you choose which monitor to display notifications on in multi-monitor setups. Menu app editing, which adds a right-click menu option to edit the properties of any application in the menu. Linux Mint 21.3 Beta, which is based on Ubuntu 20.04, LTS, features experimental Wayland support for the Cinnamon desktop, which is the flagship desktop environment of Linux Mint. This means that you can choose between Cinnamon running on Xorg, the default session, and Cinnamon running on Wayland from the login screen too. However, the Wayland session is not as stable as the Zorg session, and it may lack some features or have some compatibility problems with certain applications. The bright side of Wayland support in Linux Mint 21.3 Beta is that it is a step towards the future of Linux desktops, as many leading Linux distributions, such as Ubuntu and Fedora, have already adopted Wayland as their default display server. Wayland offers several benefits over Sorg, such as better security. Wayland prevents applications from accessing the input and output of other applications, which reduces the risk of key logging, screen recording, or spying. Better stability. Wayland handles crashes more gracefully as it isolates each application in its own buffer, which prevents the entire desktop from freezing or crashing if one application fails. Better performance. Wayland reduces the latency and overhead of rendering graphics as it communicates directly with the hardware and avoids unnecessary copying or conversion of data. Better compatibility. Wayland supports modern technologies and features, such as high DPI scaling, fractional scaling, touchscreens, gestures, and animations, which are not well supported by Sorg. These are some of the reasons uh, why Wayland support in Linux Mint 21.3 Beta is a positive development for the Linux Mint community and users. Of course, Wayland is still a work in progress, and it may take some time before it becomes the default and stable display server for Linux Mint. But you can try it out yourself and provide feedback to the Linux Mint developers who are working hard to make Cinnamon compatible with Wayland and to fix any bugs or issues that may arise. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it informative and useful. If you enjoyed it, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Your support means a lot to me and helps me create more quality content for you. Thank you and have a great day.